Hey guys, just at my local Walmart here, seeing what kind of stuff they have. It's a Tuesday night. Um, hopefully they have something new. Um, let's come down to the aisle here. Um, no new main lines. Nothing new there. Nothing new down there. Um, they just have the Buick Riviera. I think that's from the newest mix. Oh, they do have this. Is that from the... That's from the second mix of speeders. Surprised that's not taken. I don't know, leave it behind though. And... Some recent team transports. Cuda. Chevelle. Uh, the two pack, the broke R and Rap, the usuals. Uh, yeah, no surprises there. And for Boulevard, they just have the van. Uh, I figured I'd check it out tonight because they do usually stock on Tuesday, Thursday nights, at least in my area. Um, but yeah, I don't think they have put anything out tonight, so that's unfortunate. I am going to be checking a couple more stores in the morning though, so let's see what kinds of stuff we can find there. Uh, I'm just on the hunt for JKs and Xamax and... Hey guys, it's the next morning and I'm in a Walmart a little bit further away from where I live. And if this van I saw it, it was full so I decided to come look at it, but it's just old junk. So the actual Hot Wheels, the actual aisles upstairs. So I'm gonna head up there now and see what kind of stuff I can find. Okay guys, just coming up to the aisle here. It's pretty quiet this morning in this Walmart. Hey guys, so I've had to switch to voice over here since there was another collector in the aisle and I didn't wanna be disruptive, but uh, here you can see there are some cases on the top of the shelf. You've got some Matchbox mainlines, Hot Wheels themed assortment, all the usual stuff. Uh, here, there's some Matchbox mainlines. Um, looks like a new-ish case. Got the Volkswagen Golf or Bronco back there. A uh, nice new color of the Mazda RX-8 up front on that peg up there. Uh, I'm dropping the Holden Commodore on the ground. Um, but down here, there's these new neon speeders, which I hadn't yet seen hit stores. I uh, got the Porsche GT3 Cup Car, uh, BMW M3 Cup Car there. I don't think it's a Cup Car, but uh, yeah, that's a Mercedes AMG GT3. Got the Corvette C7 Z06, uh, interesting color on that one. Um, Dodge Char Challenger SRT Hellcat, sorry. Uh, I like the matte black on that. Uh, Cadillac ATS VR, um, another another one, another nice one in the set. Um, back here, this one, I'm sure this one's going to be popular. It's the McLaren F1 GTR, big fan of that one. Um, and back here, got the Ford GT in this lime green color that really really pops out when you see it in person. Uh, so yeah, that's that's the whole set right there. Got these new pop cultures over here. Haven't seen this mix before. Got the Beatles hauler there. And this one's pretty nice. The Aston Martin V8 uh, from the 007 No Time to Die. Uh, really a big fan of that one. Um, they've also got the Lotus Esprit S1. I believe they have released this one before in that color, but that's a nice re-release. Uh, now down here we do have some uh, Peg Warmer Boulevards, the Ford Anglia, and the uh, Car Culture Exotic NV2 set couple from the Forza set from last year over here. Got the Bugatti EB110. Big fan of that one. But down here we do have a themed assortment. You yeah, guys, so I just cracked open this case and it's just the Stars and Stripes. These are my two favorites from the Neon set. I don't want to spend five bucks a piece on eight of them, so I get the Ford GT as well. That's nice. I do have this motor show pack, which is pretty cool. I do already have that one. And oh, this Bilstein Jetta is beautiful. That 
crazy about the other one though. Okay, so right here we've got a Matchbox W case and a Matchbox G case. Um, I, I am opening up the W case here. It is a 2023 case. I believe it's the last mix of 2023. And there's certainly some interesting cars in here. Um, at first, I'm not seeing much. Uh, I do see this uh, McLaren 720S in the back corner there, which I thought was a super chase at first. I thought it could have been the BMW chase based on the color. Um, now over here, I thought that could have been a chase as well. Fortunately, it wasn't. How about this one, guys? 86 F-150, just beautiful. Here's an older stock, and the card's a bit bent, but... Man, oh man, that's nice. Wow. Well, there's some boulevards as well. Unfortunately, it's the T case. And unfortunately, is the wrong mix. It has the Celica and the Accord. But it doesn't have, it's not, it's not the new one with the Sylvia and all the 2024s, so... Bit of a bit of a shame, but it's all good. I don't see anything new or good in this uh, in this Matchbox case. It's just uh, another 2024 uh, G case. I did also manage to find these 143s, the Porsche 911 GT3 RS 992. Uh, this one is brand new for 2024, and it will be sought after by collectors, and it's in stores now. Here's everything I ended up getting from Walmart. I got this uh, 86 F-150 here uh, in blue, which I showed earlier. I did get this Golf Matchbox mainline, uh, which I really liked. Um, I like it, it goes with the green release really nicely. And then I did get these uh, neon speeders like you saw. I probably should have grabbed a couple more of those boulevards and stuff as well, like the Accord and the Celica. Um, but these are some good finds, and I hope to see you guys in the next video for some more Hot Wheels hunting.